Hello, my name is Carl Pover, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to create the ClickView file used in the exercises found in my book, Learning ClickView Data Visualization, if you have the ClickView Personal Edition. If you want to follow along with this video tutorial, you can download the files I will be using from my blog, Harvesting Wisdom. In the download section, the link is called Complete Learning ClickView Data Visualization Exercise Files. You can also find these same files in the PACT Publishing website. Okay, so let's get started. ClickView will tell you whether you're running the ClickView Personal Edition on the top right hand corner of the Getting Started page. What this means is that you will only be able to create ClickView files and open up ClickView files that were created by your user and your computer. If you try to open up other ClickView files created by other users and other computers, ClickView will give you an error. This includes the files needed to do the exercises in my book. So what we're going to do is create our own ClickView file from scratch. First we will click New. If the new file wizard appears, click Cancel. Right from the start we're going to click on Save. Within the zip file you can download from my blog or the packed publishing website you'll find the folder original. Within the folder original, you'll find two files, one called Sales Project Analysis Sandbox and the other called Sales Project Dashboard. The first we're going to replace is the Sales Project Analysis Sandbox. So let's click on that file to give the same name as that file to our new file. We're going to click on Save and we're going to click on Yes to overwrite the existing file. Next, we will click on the Edit Script button. Once the Edit Script window has opened, we're going to delete the current content, and we're going to add the following script. Once that has been added, let's click on Reload. ClickView will reload its data model. Once the ClickView data model has been loaded, the Sheet Properties window will appear. Click OK, and to end the exercise, click Save. We perform the same steps to replace the Sales Project Dashboard file. OK, now you're ready to start the exercises found in my book, Learning ClickView Data Visualization. I hope you learned a lot from the book, and I would appreciate any feedback you have of it. Thank you very much for watching the video tutorial, and I hope to see you around.